The construction of the Grove Mall in Vinduk is well underway, but the shopping experience will not be the only new development in the area. A 126-bed hospital will form part of the first phase of the Lady Pohamba Private Hospital that will offer services such as gynecology, neurosurgery, pediatrics and a trauma center. The project is expected to cost between 350 and 360 million dollars. Securing the funding of this initiative is said to be in the final stages and various doctors have been approached to buy in. What we've done is split it. We'd like the doctors to own a, major, a big share in the hospital. Not a majority share, but a really big share. Our model is based on the fact that doctors will own, uh, own shares in the hospital. So we've got uh, the main driving force company is Demashua Property Developers, which is the owner of the Grove Mall project in, in Namibia. Um, they will take up about 55%. Um, Lady Pahamba will be taking up 6.5%. And uh, we've got a further... 38, 39% roughly for the doctors that we've kept available. And all the every single doctor is being approached in, in the country and given an opportunity to, to buy shares in, into the project. And then based, based on the desirability, we will, we will split it from, from there. We asked where the inspiration to name the hospital after Madame Penehupifo Pohamba came from. We've been dealing with Lady Palmer for quite a while now and her, her involvement in healthcare is, is very, very strong. She, 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 she's sort of regarded as the Florence Nightingale of, of Namibia, I think. I think there's a, there's a very strong link to her in healthcare, so that was our first reason for approaching her. Our second reason, obviously, she, she's an influential person in her own right, not, not only because of, of, of her husband, but because of, of herself. She, she, she's really a fantastic person. The groundbreaking ceremony is slated for the first week of August. If everything goes according to schedule, come the 15th of March 2015, doors to a new hospital will be opened here in Vindex Kleine Cooper suburb. Not only will this create many job opportunities, but the shortage in the country's health facilities will certainly be lessened. Kodachi Sweto Brandt, reporting for the news on one.